Hi, I'm Tessa McHenry, Director of Marketing at Zodiac Pool Systems, the makers of Zodiac and Polaris Pool Cleaners. Robotic pool cleaners are an advanced and efficient way to keep your pool clean. So for all you do-it-yourselfers, we've put together some easy troubleshooting solutions to common issues that you can easily fix yourself, including wheel replacement and cord tangling. First, we're going to show you how to replace the wheels on your robotic pool cleaner. The wheels of your robotic pool cleaner are attached to the bottom housing by a two-piece keyed wheel bushing. The tab on the wheel bushing locks the wheel onto the housing. To remove a broken wheel, all you need is a T-handle Allen wrench and a flathead screwdriver. First, insert the Allen wrench into the access hole at the wheel and press down firmly on the locking lever. Next, using the flathead screwdriver, pry the wheel off the housing. Now it's time to replace the wheel. Align the three keys of the bushing with the three grooves in the housing. This is an important step because if the wheel is replaced without aligning the keys, the wheel cannot be removed in the future. Push the wheel into the housing until it locks into place. And that's it. Now we'll show you how to troubleshoot cable tangling. If you leave your robotic cleaner in the pool all the time, the cable is more likely to tangle. It's better to remove the cleaner from the pool after each cleaning cycle. Then straighten the cable out on the pool deck for a few minutes. This will help eliminate any memory from the cable. Then loop it around the hook on the caddy. Make sure to unplug the cable from the control box and do not over tighten the cable while looping as this can put undue stress on your cord connections. A good tip is to place the caddy and control unit near the center of the pool deck to limit the amount of floating cable in the pool. Be sure to keep the control box at least five feet from the pool's edge. If tangling persists, lay the floating cable out straight on the pool deck for a few hours to allow the cable to warm, making the material more pliable so any memory in the cable is removed with the warmth of the sun. Another tip is to limit the amount of cable you throw into the pool. The more excess cable, the more chance for tangling. Feed just enough cable to let the cleaner reach the far end of the pool, plus three feet or so, then zip tie the remaining cable and hang it on the caddy. Running the robotic cleaner the majority of the time on cycle one, the floor only setting, is recommended. This will extend the life of your cleaner and reduce the chance of it coming to the surface, causing additional cable tangling. By following these tips, your robotic pool cleaner will keep your pool clean all year long. 